Welcome back, everybody, to Subsistence. I am an old guy gaming, and in this episode, we are going to do... Uh, go back down to the caves and get one more batch of crystal before uh, winter sets in. So it is now November. It just turned November an in-game day or two ago. And we have our first snow now, too. Uh, it is possible to go to the caves in the winter when the lake freezes over, but it's, it's a little risky. Well, maybe, I don't know, maybe it isn't risky. We might try it sometime, but... You know, you can break through the ice from both sides, but I don't know, that just kind of creeps me out. <laughs> no, we have to break through ice. Uh, so we're going to do that. Um, we're also going to make, I think we're going to make our lever action rifle today. We've got all the ingots that we need. I got the three of those ingots from Bravo uh, that you guys saw in the opening clips there. Um, so let's see. It's going to be, we're going to need lever action. Yeah, we're going to need 210 mass. And that's going to be the thing. So let's go ahead and feed this stuff into there. And I'm going to just go ahead and run this um, because I, want, I don't want to wait for it. So we need to just make sure we keep 2100 as that builds up. All right, so while we're waiting for that, uh, our chicken is level 10. This is the only chicken I have left, so he gets to go bye-bye. See ya, buddy. Um, and so currently we don't have any chicken, so we'll have to go get some more of those, but we'll do that uh, later. Okay, so let's put uh, this chicken. Look at all this this really good food in here, man. We have got to get, <laughs> got to get that dog on a baking pan made. Uh, so many things to do. Um, after we make the lever action rifle, then the the cooking pot and baking pan are the, the next thing on the list. Now, um, unfortunately, I didn't get... Uh, the climbing axe is made uh, this year, uh, in year two. Um, so you know we'll hold off on that. I, I mean, I could, I could do this, but we're just gonna have to wait till next year um, to to go into the lava caves because it's just been one constant struggle to try and you know advance in this game because of oh I left the door open uh, because of the hunter the constant hunter attacks. But uh, all that happened last night, so I'm expecting, once again, my two days of grace. Um, so, yeah, we're going to do that. All right, now, let's, um, I want to really load up on the bandages. Let's go ahead and, see, we got three. Let's make seven more so that we have um, plenty of bandages with us down in there. We're going to take a couple of antidotes with us down there, too. Um, we're going to take a bunch of protein bars for food uh, we will run into to mushrooms down there though too so uh, yeah I don't know let's just take the protein bars we should run into mushrooms down there and then um, I've got tons of water so we're gonna actually grab those stacks of water but I'm not gonna take all of that down with me you know what we could do we could Make a whole mess of blueberry water, couldn't we? Uh, well, no, I want to save these blueberries for jam because, you know, once winter sets in, we won't be able to pick them again until spring. So, yeah, we'll take... Uh, I'm sure one stack of water is going to be enough. How much does one of these give us for hydration? Yeah, I, I think one stack is good enough. Let's just take one stack down with us. Uh, I'm going to leave the canteens here. Okay. Okay. Um, and we'll, yeah, we'll top off our food right before we leave. Okay, so where are we at on the mass? We're at 162, and we just dipped below, uh, so, uh, on that. So I'm gonna, uh, turn these guys both on. Uh, we got a ton of biofuel. I've got over two stacks of biofuel, which is good. Uh, just because I've just been killing a lot of wolves and bears and whatnot. I still don't go out of my way to kill bears, but if they get, get in my way, I'm just killing them now that we have the double barrel. Okay, so wow, look, it's really coming down out there. So let's see, we gotta, we just have, basically we're just waiting on the, on the mass and power to make this thing. What else do we need though? Let's get everything else ready. So we're gonna need twenty of these. I know I've been feeding them into the thing when we need them, but it doesn't matter because I, I mean, I, I just get so many of these. Uh, that yeah, it just doesn't matter. Okay, so and then two, 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 and six ports. One, two, three, four, five, six. Um. Two days ago, I went out looting, and I had the best nail day I've ever had in this game. I brought home 
110 nails from one looting session. Couldn't believe it. It's the most nails I've ever gotten in one looting session. Uh, so yeah, that was cool. Uh, okay, so we have everything to make this except for the mass and power. So let's see, where are you, where's the mass at? Okay, let's just let that continue on. Uh, with the two Jennies running, it's going to, you know, keep it from get dropping so low that then we have to wait forever for the power to go up. Uh, so let's see, while we're waiting for that, uh, let's get our diving gear ready to go. So we're going to need that. And we managed to get down there and back with one tank, but you know what? Let's not let's not risk it. Let's just take. Uh, yeah, let's not risk it. We'll take two tanks with us. I also think let's do a couple more medi packs too. So we need uh, that and that. Yeah. So we'll we'll take a total of five medi packs down there with us just in case. You never know, right? You never know. You don't want to die in the cave, because if you die in the cave, you almost certainly are not going to get your stuff back. It's just almost impossible to get everything back. So, uh, speaking of which, uh, we are not going to bring the shotgun down there. Um, we're not going to bring the bow down there. We're going to bring only going to bring the pistol and the magnum with us. So here again, that way, if we if we do bite the dust, um, you know, we're we're not. We're only losing that. We're not taking the lever action down there either. We're making it today, but we're not taking it down there. Uh, let's make sure these guys are in full repair. Okay. Uh, so those are good. My armor's in good shape. I know it would suck really, really bad if we lost our armor down there too, but... Um, I mean, I've got padded cloth and cotton to recover from that. It would be a, a, an incredibly expensive recovery but we could still do it if we had to um i don't want to go down there without armor okay we got 27 magnum rounds so if we're careful that should uh that should work for us and uh okay so yeah we got the diving gear all right how are we doing just about to our 210 mass and then we'll turn that thing off and then with both of the jennies running the power will shoot back up really quick um, so yeah, like I said, once this is made, then the next steps are uh, boiling pan and baking pan. And honestly, I should make the baking pan first because I've got so much of that high-end, you know, uh, moose and chicken stuff in here. So we probably will, and then maybe we'll do the baking pan last, week, or the baking uh, cooking pot. We need the cooking pot for tomato soup and for um, for jam. Uh, that's why I've been hoarding, you know, the strawberries, and we got all these rosehip berries from last winter, and then, we're, of course, we're going to bring more in this winter. Um, so, yeah, we'll make some jam, too. All right, so let's see. Are you at 210? Yes. Okay, so let's turn this off, and then we'll just wait for these guys to get us back to, what is it, 2100 that you want? Yeah, 2100. Okay, so while we're waiting for that, let's go out here. And I have some crops that I believe are ready, so let's go ahead and harvest them. And we might... Well, yeah, I'll probably turn the lights back on before we leave, because we'll probably be down there after dark, A, and B, you know, with this weather. Oh, I guess that stuff's not done yet. Those are done. Okay, so everything else that's in there is still... We're still going. All right, we've got these seeds here, so let's plant them first. Um, and we'll maybe we'll put them in here, and then let's do another onion seed. Okay, and then we got a full crop plot here, so I think uh, we should go put everything else in here, right? Okay, yeah. Let's go see what our ratio of veggies are. Okay, so we got a bunch of potatoes, a bunch of carrots. We're really low on onions because I, I make a lot of liver and onions from those. So I think we're going to do a full plot of onions. We got 18 more cotton, so now we're up to 72 cotton, which is really good. All right, you up to 2100 yet? You're working on it. So let's uh, just plant the whole thing of onions. Okay, that's good to go. 
And you guys, let's let's top off. I'm just gonna throw that in there. Let's top off the water. And I'm not gonna worry too much about the fertilizer. Oh, I guess we already have the water. So two and you, two and you, two and you, and oh, you're you're already at 99 percent. Okay. Alrighty. Let's put these back in here. So yeah, I just wanted to get, you know, one more load of crystal. Um, so we have it, you know, throughout the winter. We still have, what do we have? We still have 21 in here. But yeah, we need to get more. I've got 69 glass and 28 glass panes. And all that's from looting. I haven't made a single piece of glass so far in this playthrough that's crazy okay we got it we got it here we go look at this guys lever action rifle boom baby fantastic okay cool uh so let's top you off and we're gonna turn you off but top you off and there she is Look at this beauty. All right, awesome. But, like I said, we're going to put it right away. <laughs> no way I'm taking that down in the cave, at least not right now, um, and risking losing it. So, okay, so we got our magnum shells. Uh, we don't need to take shotgun shells down there because we're not doing it. Let's grab all these nines. Nines are super easy to replace. Uh, those can go in there. We'll take that with us. We got our water, our protein, uh, all that stuff. Uh, we don't need to take the arrows down there. Let's try to get everything situated here. Let's put these down on our toolbar so they're easy to get to. And yeah, I think that's it. I think we're ready to go. Let's uh, top you off. Okay, and we already hit this, right? Yeah, we did. Okay. Now, last thing we have to top off is ourselves. So let's... Um, Drink both of those waters, and then we'll put them in the stove so they're ready for us when we get back. All right, we're going to keep that on, you know, just so we can get everything nice and charged back up and we don't have to worry about our fridge going out while we're gone. Okay, speaking of fridge, let's go ahead and have ourselves a steak and eggs. And that pretty much tops us off there. Let's chow down on a couple naters. And does that get us all the way? Yep, that gets us all the way. All right, guys, I think we are ready to go here. Am I am I forgetting something? I probably am. I'm just not sure. Oh, yes, I am. Pick. We want an extra pick while we're down there. Um, what do we need that? Yeah. Yeah, we definitely want an extra pick so we can get as much crystal as we can. I don't think we need more than one spare. Um, okay. All right, let's do this. Let's do this. So we're basically just going to uh, swim out to the cave. We'll put the scuba gear on once we get right above the cave. And then head on down. Next year, um, we will go... We'll go check out the north cave. But we can actually get to the north cave uh, through the lava tunnel. Um... But I'd like to spend a little more time in it, just because I'm not as familiar with it as the South Cave. I know the South Cave really well, because I've just been in it so many times. Okay, so we are here. Um, let's go ahead and put on our scuba tank and head on down. Hopefully we can get a bunch of crystal while we're down here. There's a pearl there, but... Let's just not worry about that. We can get those anytime. Well, actually, not necessarily those either. But I've got a bunch of pearls. I've got close to 70 pearls. That should be enough to last us through the winter, I'm sure. If it isn't, we're probably not doing something right. Okay. Do we see any campfires really close by? 
We do not. Okay, I don't see any crystal over there. So let's go to shore here. And we'll put this back on. And let's start looking for crystal. We gotta watch out for our friend the bat too. Do we see him up there at all? Oh, uh, you know what? This would be a great place to bring a flashlight, weapon flashlight down. Maybe we'll do that in the future. Maybe we will do that in the future. Because then you can shine it right up in there and you can see those dang bats. Take them out for they even know what hit them. All right, I'm not seeing anything over here crystal-wise. There's some shrooms. Let's grab those. Those, um, those actually work. They give you carbs, protein, um, and a little hydration. So they're actually quite useful. Man, where in the heck's all the crystal? Okay, there's some there, and that might... No, I don't think that's coal. There's usually a bat right around in here somewhere, just waiting for him to pop out and be a nuisance. Oh, crap. The hunters are right around the corner from having to cross over there. That's going to be fun. All right. There's some more crystal there. Before we go all the way down there, let's kind of cross over to this side, though. There's the bat right there. It's a little far away. Oh, he went back up. All right, let's try and get him again. Really? Okay, what's he gonna do? He's right there. We hit him. He's angry. <laughs> He's angry. Oh good, we got phosphate, crystal, all the good stuff. Oh, the little bastard got us. Okay. They always drop two things of skin so you can uh, turn those right back into bandages. Oh, what's... Oh, never mind. That, at, that, at first glance, that looked like a bat head. I'm going, what? Is there trophies in here now? In this game? <laughs> oh. Hilarious. Can you wash your hands with the, with the, with this? Oh, you can. Good. Okay. We don't need to do that in here, of course, but um, when we get in the lava zone, there's not going to be any water down there, so. Uh, we can make incendiary uh, rounds now with the lever action. You have to have the lever action rifle to use those. Right, there could be some hunters up this way, so let's be careful. There's more crystal up there, good. Okay, got some shrooms. That's the way we came in, so okay. I think this room is clear unless they're way back around the corner there. Okay, let's go take a look down here really quick. Getting across the, the water there is going to be interesting with those hunters like right by the shore. All right, so it looks like everything's clear down this way. A 
love grabbing the coal and using it for for, for fuel because then it saves our wood. It should it should burn for longer too because it would in real life A and B. Uh, you know it's harder to get so, but it doesn't. It's the same burn time as as wood. I love this game, but there's some there's some weird balancing that cold games has in it that I think need to be tweaked, and that's one of them. That's one of them. All right, let's go over here and grab this crystal node. And yeah, there's our buddies right there. Oh, you know what though? Yeah, they're right by the shore, aren't they? Their fire's not right by the shore. It's back a little ways. Okay, I think we've cleared out this cavern. Let's uh, assess this situation. There's a guy walking right there. Uh, I could try and take a pot shot at him, but... I don't know. Let's just uh, see if we can get... I have no cover here is the problem. All right. Let's go back around this way. I don't know if they would try and cross the pond to get, get at us or not. If they do, that would be awesome. Because then they're going to be sitting ducks in the water. Okay, what are they doing? Oh, okay. Oh, crap. Oh, man, come on, OG. Cannot afford to be wasting ammo like that. I, I can't see him very well is the problem. Oh, for goodness sakes. Alright, what is he going to do? They're running all the way back there. Okay. Let's take this opportunity to move in. like that guy just appeared out of nowhere. I couldn't say for sure, though. That's why we bring a bunch of bandages down here. And, okay. And as you can see, these guys don't really drop anything all that fantastic. It's Seems to be on par with what rogues would drop up topside. I mean, gears are nice, though. Don't get me wrong about that, but still. Okay, that was uh, <laughs> that was not not very well executed on my part. Ah, uh, what can you do though, right? Since we have a f their fire here, let's go ahead and cook this, and we'll actually have some cooked meat. And we'll hang on to that and take it back to the uh, mass recycler thing. Oh, we even got a fire starter, too. Nice. Okay. Yeah, that was terrible shooting. Terrible, terrible, terrible. Uh, okay. So, yeah, we'll wait for this to finish. I guess we can grab the ash, too. We can always dump that if we end up running out of room. Um, let me just take a quick peek back here. We'll go grab this coal. I don't want to get too far away or we'll end up burning the meat there. Okay, come on. Come on, come on. We don't have all day. Okay. Eat the steak. Have a shroom to get some carbs. Maybe two shrooms to get some carbs. And a drink of water. And we are in good shape. Okay, let's go. 
Uh, we're going to run to the end of this tunnel to see if there are is any crystal down here. And then we'll go down the other pathway to get into the next large cavern. Okay, I don't see any crystal notes, so let's go back around the other way. Okay, so this is the second and larger cavern in the south cave. And I see a couple things of coal. There's probably going to be another hunter camp somewhere in this cavern, so we've got to keep our eyes open for them, as usual. Let's grab the coal here. And keep looking for crystal. Okay, there's not going to be anything there. Let's uh, take a peek over here real quick. Yeah. I don't see anything. There's some crystal. Okay, there's the hunter's way over that way. Let's go down towards the lava cave entrance, but of course we can't actually get down there. But we'll check and see if there are any nodes in the passageway. If not, then we'll circle back around. Okay, nope, don't see anything. Yeah, we will go down there next year. That is the plan. I just got to get those climbing axes, and they are expensive. Okay, let's go around this way. Uh, we got to be careful of the hunters. There's some crystal there. I think their campfire was over that way somewhere. Can we get this? Oh no, this is this is phosphate. Okay, can we get this without breaking this pick? I think so. Yeah. Can we get this coal without breaking the pick? I'd like to take it back for the mass recycler. Okay, that is the last that we're gonna use of that guy. Okay, let's go this way. There's a coal there. This is that spot that I, I'm guessing is going to be the entrance down here from, from land, uh, which is supposed to come in a future update from what I understand. All right, where's that campfire at? There's nothing around that way. Get it. There they are over there. Okay, let's go over here. We'll do a little bit of a reconnoiter here. Yeah, I want to get to that crystal. And there's a coal over there. Let's go grab this first. I wonder if we could... Um, oh, okay. Let's take a drink. <laughs> I wonder if we could pull him away without attracting the other guys. I don't know. They're all kind of clustered together. Okay, that's fine. Let's go up this way. I would I would avoid them if there wasn't crystal here, but since there's crystal here, we're going to get it. Alright, so... Let's take a 
peek around this corner. There's the fire right there. Oh. Okay. And there's crystal over here. Where's that damn bat? Oh, this is not good. Okay, here. Take one of those. Um. Okay. I hear the bat. I don't see the bat. And he infected us, too. Where's that bastard at? Let's take one of these. I don't even see him. Is he an invisible bat? What the heck, man? He obviously hit us because we became infected. I don't know. I'm confused. Oh, here comes the other one. Okay. Did we get the backpack from this guy? No, we didn't. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Son of a gun. This is not going well. Whew. Okay. Oh man, I feel like I'm I'm not doing doing the, the best uh, my best work here, guys. <laughs> I'm not doing my best work here. Oh, for goodness sakes! All right, hey, we got some more meat, so let's cook that up. And uh, okay, so we got the backpack off of the one dude, and this yeah, okay. I was gonna say I thought there was another backpack. Yeah. Supposedly these are the most dangerous hunters in the game, but if they if they even are, I don't really find them to be that much more dangerous than any other hunter. But they just don't drop anything good, man. They should be dropping high end stuff if they're the hard the toughest hunters. That is the way it should be, in my humble opinion, which you're all entitled to. All right, while we're waiting for this, let's go ahead and chow down on both of those shrooms, and that'll get our carbs up. In fact, that gets our protein up pretty good, too. And then we'll eat this guy, and then we'll... Uh, there's another crystal right there. We'll go grab that and then start heading back. We could possibly run into another repopped hunter, depending upon what time it is. Or a hunter group, rather. Um, I don't. I have no idea what time it is. Okay, good. So we are in good shape. Our health is just about all the way back. And uh, our uh, food and water and all that's good. Get this coal and the crystal. All right, I don't believe there's anything over this way. Yeah, it just uh, stops right there. And that's where we came in at. Right down through there. Let's take one last quick look. Make sure nothing we missed something or something might have spawned in behind us, possibly. Before we head back out of here.
Ah, look at that. That probably spawned in because I'm sure we would have seen it coming up this way. So most likely it did. Let's go peek up here one more time. Nope, nothing up there. Okay. Let's head on back. Oh, we got new hunters up that way. Okay, that's actually a good place for them to be because then we can totally avoid them. So that means it's past midnight now. And hopefully we'll have a few more nodes that have spawned in too. And we'll probably have to deal with one more bat before it's all said and done. Yep. There he is. These guys are amazingly hard to hit, like every other thing in this game that's in motion. I don't think Cold Games gives you any aim assist whatsoever, which is fine. But, I don't know, there seems like there's times when I'm spot on in the sights and they still it still misses when they're in motion at least i'd like to s tell myself that whether you guys buy it or not i don't know but i don't care because as long as i buy it it makes me feel better about myself <laughs> uh anyway all right so let's see yeah come on crystals oh there's some oh those are mushrooms yeah we'll grab mushrooms why not mushrooms are good but we want crystal. That's what we need. I don't know. It doesn't seem like we're getting quite as much crystal on this run as we did on our first run. Here in Season 2. We came back with a pretty nice haul. There's a crystal up there. Okay, let's cut across over here. Just being mindful that the hunters are down this direction. But I think they're pretty far over that way. Yeah, they're like right there. Let's go up and around. We'll kind of swing over to the left and take a peek through. Not there, but... Uh, can't we get over through here? Yeah, I was going to say. Yeah, there's some. Two. Very nice. Very, very nice. All right, let's take a peek around the corner here, and then we're going to head out. Yeah, they're just right around the corner there. Okay, good. So what are we coming out of here with? 60? That's not too bad, I guess. That's not too bad. I think we had just a little bit more than that the first time, but I'm happy with 60. Maybe we didn't. I don't know. Uh, we have used some of it for various things. But, you know, this new haul, along with what we still have, should, I would think, anyways, should tide us over for, for the winter. And then, you know, next year will be, you know, I should have everything made by then. You know, all the expensive stuff made by then, and then... You know, we'll be able to spend more time down in the caves and doing other things. Okay, let's go. 
All right, we are out of the caves. Um, I might actually spend a little bit of time down here and grab some more uh, pearls in particular and, and kelp before we surface and just use this other tank up. We might as well. Though, actually, I'm not really seeing much. Usually there's quite a bit down. Well, there's, there is some down here. So, yeah, let's just grab... I don't really need or want sandstone. I'd like to, you know, grab a half dozen pearls or so while we're still down here, but I don't know. Maybe we're not going to get lucky. Looks like there might be one to... Yeah, a couple down this way. We've got to watch our air tank. It doesn't, they don't last very long. <laughs> But since we're not planning on doing anything more um, through the winter, I'm not really worried about using them up. Plus, they're they're pretty cheap to make anyways. And even cheaper if we go raid Bravo and use their power and mass to make them. be cool if you could actually see like the big fish like the salmon and stuff down here there's a couple more pearls and then um i don't know what what will happen in the next episode we we have a pretty decent amount of nails so we might do some more building in the next episode um there's a lot there's a lot more to come in terms of you know the base and what i want to do with it so yeah maybe we'll plan on that tentatively but we'll see how things go but anyways Guys, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode, and if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel, leave a comment, and share out the video, and we will catch you in the next episode. Bye-bye.